What's up, guys? Dana Payne here, and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to do a front flip. This is an easier way than my last ways to do it because both my brothers tried this method, and within the first 20 minutes, they're already landing it. So, yeah. There's basically only like three steps to doing this, and the first step you can just do on the ground. You just have to be able to do a somersault, so I think we can all do that, hopefully. And if not, it's just a, like, I'll show you guys if you can't do that. Uh, it's really easy, like, freaking baby style. Watch how sick this is. Intense somersaulting. Oh, that was crazy, dude. Okay, but yeah, you get it. Now, if you can do that, there's only two more steps to getting the front flip. The first one I call the knee flip. So, what you're doing for this step is, well, it's kind of obvious. It's just a front flip off your knees, right? So, here, I'm gonna put this on. Sorry, this tramp is really squeaky. That's probably gonna fall. So, we're still gonna see. Hopefully it doesn't. Now, what it is, is you just wanna get really comfortable with dropping to your knees, right? Just really dropping to your knees. Get really comfortable, get really comfortable with that, and then practice with your hands like this. Okay, I knew it was gonna fall. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, I'll put it in the old spot. Yeah, you want to practice with your hands. So, this is what that should look like when you're practicing with your hands. This is what it should look like. Right, and just put your hands down for a split second. So if you put your hands down for like a split second to twirl you around, that is like all you need. And now you wanna slowly get more comfortable into doing that just without your hands. So this is, this is what it will look like without your hands. Yeah. Uh, if you can do that, if you were able to get that down, uh, you're able to front flip. So I'm actually way worse at doing that than doing the front flip. Like, I used to be pretty good at knee flip. It's just, I haven't done it anymore. So, it's, yeah. Once you're able to do the knee flip, okay, you're able to go from doing landing on your knees to landing on your feet. And if you're able to go from your knees doing the flip and then landing on your feet, you are ready to do a front flip. Now, the really important things, though, with this flip, like, for example... Um, when you're throwing your hands, you really want to lean forward with it. Like, if you're just throwing your hands and then grabbing your knees, nothing's going to work. You're just going to stay here. You've got to, like, lean, send all your weight forward with the, uh, um, flip, with your hands. Now, the next step to this is, um, the actual flip. So... You might start off just landing on your butt, and that is okay. Um, remember, when you start the rotation of your front flip, you're not gonna go any higher. So, you really wanna be careful with, with the time, like, the one problem my brothers are having is as soon as, like, before they even, like, fully left the ground on the tramp, they'd start their flip, and they wouldn't make it any further. And then the time that they started, like, doing it right when they were high in the air, like right before they started to come down, like they were like, like, yeah, right when they started to come back down from their jump, they started to flip and they would land it. So you guys should definitely work on the timing of the flip. Now here, I'm gonna show you a few examples of what this should look like. So first, this is what it should not look like, okay? Do not do what I'm about to do. See, it is impossible to land it when you are doing it right as you are leaving the ground. Now, this is what you should do. So watch this one carefully, because this is the way, if you do this way, you're going to land it. Now, all you have to do is wait till you're in the air, 
and you are able to land the flip. Now, a really important thing I'm gonna show you guys, that that's everything I need to show you on the trip. Now, some important things, okay? Like the way that you should be curled up in a ball to start the rotation. There are two different ways. Um, for the tutorial, I'm just showing you guys in a ball like this, grabbing my shins, my knees. But how I normally do it, I'm grabbing like this. But when you're starting, this is the best way to do it, right? Throw over and grab your knees and curl up in a ball. Now, if you're able to land front flips, you might want to start shifting over to this way because you're going to spin so much faster. Okay? And I really hope you guys are able to land this one. And if you're not, you guys, um, you're going to land this, trust me. If you're not able to, though, there are a tutorial by this YouTuber called Pygmy. He's really good. That's how I learned front flips, front 360s, back flips, everything. And yeah, so if you guys aren't able to land this, make sure to check him out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.